What is up guys? What shall we do next, Akins? How are you all doing? So first of all, I wanted to thank you guys um, for watching my videos, all the likes and comments and support you guys have been giving me lately. It's awesome. It really, really, really uh, means a lot to me. You guys have no idea how much this means to me. Um, and the fact you guys stick around uh, really does mean so much to me. It's hard to explain, but uh, a lot of people seem to say, a lot of haters, and I know I'm not really... You know, it's not really, uh, I don't really like to respond to haters, sometimes I screw around with them in the comment section, but I never make a personal video to them like I am now, but I just wanted to clear this up. Uh, so a lot of haters say, um, he's only in it for the money, I was reading some comments, and most majority of the comments are awesome, but you guys say, and I'm proud to be able to watch how we do next again. Uh, which is amazing. I really appreciate that. I cannot believe how many of you guys are uh, sticking around. But uh, some people are like, he's in it for the money. He's just doing this for the money. Me, me, me. And you know what? I, I just wanted to say, first of all, I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. I always said I was going to be honest with you guys. I'm not going to be one of those YouTubers who just lies and pretends to be something he's not. And well, I mean, I, I obviously put on a character and stuff in my videos. Um, but you know, I don't want to. I want to be completely honest with you guys about why I do videos and stuff like that, okay? And first of all, I'm not in it for the money. I didn't start YouTube for the money. When I first started my channel, it was to entertain people. I did not know you could get money off YouTube. That is how I started doing YouTube videos. And the reason I started was because I always, always, always wanted to be an actor. And the passion for acting and entertaining people only ever got stronger as I got older. And the, thing, the fact that I wasn't doing what I love to do got me seriously depressed. I was seriously depressed. And this goes for most YouTubers out there. Every YouTuber who is pretty successful on YouTube will always say if they have like a video where they talk about themselves rather than just doing what they do in their videos, uh, they will always tell you a little story. And I guarantee you the majority of them say they were, when they started out they were depressed. They were not doing what they loved. They wanted to be an actor. They wanted to do something like that. And if they don't, then they probably, uh, there's probably a reason for that. The reason they're not telling you. But uh, the majority of people have that reason. Um, and it always seems to be the same thing. And the thing is, when you want to be an actor, we, I mean, come on, we live in the 20, 21st century, and it's basically almost completely impossible to become an actor uh, you know it's so hard everybody's trying to do it and it's just you have to go first of all get an agent and then you have to get uh, go to auditions and if you don't get an audition which the majority of the time you won't you have to deal with a whole bunch of rejection you got to travel up and down the country or around the world wherever you live um, to go to these auditions and you're probably not gonna get them costs so much money and people that don't have that kind of money uh, with YouTube I'm still getting to do what I want to do I'm still getting to act and be on camera I like to do stuff in front of a camera and entertain people and have views have fans have an audience that actually can comment and I can actually see what people think about me and my videos and it's so it's so awesome it's like you can act in the comfort of your own home and uh, this is just this is the reason I started doing YouTube and I, I gotta be honest when I, I I'm not in it for the money okay I do get paid by YouTube but honestly I don't make a fucking billion dollars or whatever um, like some people think you do on YouTube people think oh you're a youtuber you must be having lots of money no it's not like that at all it's really not even close actually uh, it's just yeah, I mean, if I want to be able to do what I love, I, I might as well earn money off it so I can, I mean, if I got really big enough and I could do this full-time, like a full-time job, uh, oh my god, can you imagine how awesome that life would be to be doing what I love in my own home and earning money while doing it instead of having to do it and then go work a 9-to-5 job in some kind of uh, place that I don't want to live makes me depressed stuff like that and you know it's that's the way it is and uh, that's the reason I started YouTube I wanted to I'm just gonna say it. I wanted fame I always wanted to be famous not for the attention 
just because I like I don't like the way I feel about being an average kind of guy who just lives a normal life I, I feel like I have I'm not choosing to live like this and feel like this I feel like I have been chosen to to feel like this so I can I feel like I'm being tested against and I, I'm something wants me to really like try and this is the whole reason I'm trying my hardest to get myself out there on YouTube so every one of you guys it really means a lot to me and I'm not in it for the money this is what pisses me off about people but you know well it doesn't piss me off it's just pretty pathetic that people would actually go and check out my videos and then just come and say oh you only does it for the money no I don't I've invested probably around three or four thousand dollars into equipment just so I can make these videos lighting computers cameras all kinds of stuff and I didn't pay for that off YouTube money I paid for that off out of my own money my birthday money Christmas money money I worked for in a job that I hated and wanted to end my life every day stuff like that that is how and then I'm doing this because I love to read your comments you guys know I try and reply to every single comment and I have an idol uh, if you guys don't know who Roman Atwood is go check him out he's a YouTube prankster but he also has a vlog channel Roman Atwood vlogs um, and he posts daily vlogs and every single day he's just this I don't know how to explain it he's a really inspirational guy and he pretty much went through a really fucked up time in his life uh, going back so many years ago he had a girlfriend who cheated on him um, he he you know he was working a dead-end job he didn't he, all he wanted to do was be in front of a camera and entertain people and be uh, working comedy and stuff like that and he just he did it he's now got a million subscribers on his vlog channel recently hit a million subscribers and everything he says in his video he always says smile more never give up stuff like that and it really keeps me going not because I want money I don't care about money I would go broke and still do what I do because I like the feeling I get uh, from entertaining people from um, I like to be known by people I you know how awesome it would be for to have a bunch of people come over to me and be like oh my god I love your videos stuff like that would make me feel good in here and not about what's going in the bank you know what I mean I just wanted to clear this up but uh, anyway guys I really want to thank you guys for sticking around it really means a lot to me stay stay tuned though I have I know I've been posting a lot of Papinia, uh, Papinia Stewart videos lately and um but also I have uh, I've been trying to write down some ideas and stuff and I've got a pretty pretty good ideas and you know I like to help you guys out too I'm not all about me I like to try and uh, I know a lot of you guys everybody asks for shout outs this is one of the most common questions can I have a shout out and I'm sorry if I give one person a shout out everyone's gonna want one and then nobody will watch the videos because all it's gonna be is shout outs in every video so I'm sorry that's the reason I can't do it glad you guys understood um but I still, I'm trying to think of a way, uh, which I will talk about my ideas in another video. I have a list right here of stuff to do for videos. So, uh, and also, if you guys have any ideas what you would like to see me do, or if there's anything you would like, I don't know, whatever. Go hit it in the comment section right now. Let me know you're proud to be a What Shall We Do Next Again. If you don't want to type any ideas, just say, hey, I'm proud to be a What Shall We Do Next Again. And uh, I'll say, hey, thank you, and go hit that like button. Let's see how many likes we can get on this video. See how many of you guys are true. Watch how we do next again, soldiers. Okay, go hit that like button. Let's see if we can get 70 likes on this video. We've been smashing that like button lately. So go do your thing. Go destroy that like button. Uh, I'm actually thinking about changing, and some of you guys may be disappointed. Some of you guys will probably be happier because uh, the whole swag dog thing uh, with the swag hat, you know, that was just, um, I don't even know how that started, actually. Uh, I think it was on Chet Roulette and it just started. I was like, swag dogs. But some people know it was a joke. Some people kind of like, no, that's gay. I'm not saying that. Uh, but uh, since I started saying, what shall we do next to Kins, you guys have been digging that. So yeah, I think we're going to change to that. But uh, whatever, I don't know. Let me know what you <laughs> Let me know what you guys think. And I'll talk to you later. Peace out and thanks for sticking around. I really do love you guys. That's all for now, my swagalicious homie dogs. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button, uh, that favorite button, and uh, that subscribe button. 
Also, leave your comment in the comment section down below. And uh, while you're still here, go check out my other things. Links are in the description. And I'll uh, check out my other channels, too. And until next time, peace out. I love ya.